Assalamu alaikum everyone. How are you all? Welcome back to the channel. I hope you guys are doing well. Alhamdulillah, we are all doing good too. My Pakistan trip vlogs are coming to an end. We have reached the last week of our trip and it's Ramadan, mashallah. So Ramadan is a blessed month and alhamdulillah, we got the opportunity to spend this month with our family in Pakistan, even if it was only for a week. Um, it is a tradition in our family that we buy large boxes of dates or kajur and distribute it in our neighborhood for Ramzan. Here, my mother-in-law was saying Bismillah on the dates and making little packets for all the neighbors in our area. The kids of the family were then taking the packets and distributing them um, to all the houses. Mashallah, mashallah, um, may we have this privilege and opportunity to earn sawab in the blessed month of ramzan and be able to spend this beautiful time with our families inshallah um i've actually never um spent ramzan in pakistan or eid in pakistan for that matter so this whole experience even if it was just for a week it was very different for me and i actually really enjoyed it um because having iftar with the whole family mashallah it was just so nice um here we were having pizza for iftar one time so if i compare it with pizza in Canada, Canada, it was actually quite different in taste. I feel like in Canada, the pizza it focuses more on the sauce and spices, while in Pakistan, there's a lot of cheese and milder sauces. But overall, alhamdulillah, it was really tasty. And for iftar, what beats a pizza, you know? Um, before our flight, my sister in law actually invited us over to her house for iftar, and mashallah, she had organized a whole feast. May Allah bless her with lots of happiness and success in this world and the hereafter. She truly made everything with a lot of love and she made all of our favorite dishes like my husband loves this kabuli palau and she made it one more time before we left you know um she also made this delicious daibare it looked and tasted so good mashallah like i definitely have to get this recipe from her alhamdulillah after spending a week of ramadan in pakistan and a whole month in pakistan it was finally time for our flight back to canada <laughs> We actually had a stopover at Dubai on the way and it was about 22 hours long. So Emirates provided us with accommodation and food. They have a rule, I believe, that if you have a stopover over 7 hours and the flight is the next available one, then they will provide you a hotel and food. Um, they do have more details about this. So if you're traveling and you have any stopovers in Dubai like this, make sure to read the fine print and figure out if you could avail these services too. Um, so they had a shuttle service that would take us to the hotel um as we were heading out the airport to the shuttle bus i actually saw this flower shop and i fell in love like isn't this so pretty this is the prettiest flower shop i've ever seen like it was beautifully set up and it had such an elegant presentation it honestly made me want to buy the flowers <laughs> so i think this is a very smart business approach mashallah i love flowers and this whole look of the shop just blew me away um but yeah we then headed out to the shuttle bus it wasn't that much of a walk uh we are staying at the copthorn airport hotel so we basically went over to the shuttle bus and they took us to the hotel
The hotel reception area was very fancy and they had quick service because we had a lot of people in the shuttle bus with us and they checked everyone in quite quickly. The hotel overall was nice and clean. Um, the concierge took up the bags for us and we headed up to the room. Xavier was really excited to get to the room and we were staying on the first floor in room 1065. The hotel itself was very ideally located so it was about eight minutes um, drive from the airport so it was really close to the airport and it was also about like 12 minutes drive to like Dubai mall or like the center of the city basically so it was really nicely um, located and here is our room mashallah it's a really nice room with two double beds and some sofas it was quite interesting to see a hairdryer beside the mirror here because usually they're in the washroom but i think this one was really smart um here is the view from our room and you can see that they have you know a few swimming pools the hotel does have a swimming pool um you can see you know the traditional dubai palm trees that dubai is known for and a lot of other hotels and buildings around it sure that you guys can tell just by looking at the view how hot it was in the way like honestly you can just see the heat through the video um and this was the uh, washroom of our room it was actually a really decent sized washroom pretty big i would say we were very happy with our room and the hotel overall the staff were very nice the service was very quick so you know what else can you ask for <laughs> um so what happened was in the stopover we didn't have our check-in bags and i had put zoe's pack and play in the check-in bag so i asked the hotel if they had a crib and they did so they brought them up to her room um, after freshening up we were all really hungry so we headed downstairs to their restaurant for lunch they had a huge lounge area where they serve breakfast lunch and dinner so they had a lot of food options ranging from like you know various deli meats and um the famous you know a traditional hummus and garlic sauce uh in today's menu they did have achari chicken and like a beef salad dish uh they had white rice and dal as well They had a lot of authentic traditional Arabic food, um, which was really nice. We got to taste their traditional food. Mashallah, we really enjoyed the food and everything tasted great. Um, this was their drink section where they served juices, soft drinks, coffee, and tea. We grabbed a cappuccino on the way back to our room. Um, by this point, we were all super tired and maxed out on energy. So we wanted to get back to the room and get some rest before we go out to explore a little bit um, of Dubai. Our overall review of the emirates hotel and service was that it was pretty great highly highly recommend the hotel was amazing with quick service and very kind staff and the food in their restaurant was delicious they had a lot of options a lot of varieties um so yeah i will end this vlog here and inshallah i will meet you guys in my next video where we explore a little bit of the way take care of yourselves and allah hafiz